September the 26th, 2013. It's Thursday, everyone. Happy Thursday. Woo. It's throwback celebrity Thursday, you know, because all these celebrities, you know, they don't get mentioned on the news or something. We like to mention them on our show because all the, every celebrity means a lot to us, okay? So, anyway, you know, Halloween is around the corner. I mean, everyone will be going trick-or-treat, knocking on my door for some candy. Yes, I remember when I did that when I was a little kid, like, trick-or-treat. I always used to be so scared to go up to someone's house. I don't know why. My grandma says that you have begged us to take you sugar straight. Now you go up to that door and ring the doorbell and get you some candy. I used to be like, Grandma, can you go for me? My grandma would have to go for me because I used to be so, <laughs> so embarrassed. I don't, I'm not the one coming trick or treat. My grandkids in the car, they wanted me to come do it. So, I mean, people would laugh and they would give her candy and go on. <laughs> so, anyway, those years are over, though. No more trick or treat for me. Um, but anyway, um, you know, people are already decorating because this, this is the last week of September. And, you know, people like to decorate and show their Halloween decorations for the whole month of October. And I'm a big Halloween decorator, too. I love to decorate for Halloween. I mean, I love to decorate for any holiday. And I think I've mentioned that on our show before. I love to decorate. I love to decorate for Thanksgiving, Christmas, Valentine's Day, Father's Day, you know, Mother's Day. I mean, I'll put up little Mother's Day stuff in my room or just fill out the words Mother's Day and put it somewhere in my room until it ends. Or, you know, Easter. I mean, I love all type of holidays, and I love to decorate. And um, is a, we had took a question, everyone, seeing their comment. Well, you know, there, we took a poll. And we put, is the 26th too early for Halloween decorations? You know, people have put their Halloween decorations up about two weeks ago. That's what my, because my grandpa was telling me, said, hey, no, if people on our road put up our, already put up our Halloween decorations. I'm like, what, really? I mean, it's only still September. So, um, yes, 48% say yes, and no, 56% said no, it's not too early to put up Halloween decorations on the 26th. Um, you know, considering today is the 26th, I, you know, my, my dad, you know, because my sister and me and my dad, we like to help out. My mom, you know, she does a lot of things in the house and does Halloween decorating in the house. And we do decorating outside for Halloween, so, you know, people that ride by can see all the pretty twinkly lights. As Kelly Ripper would say, <laughs> uh, we mostly duck around on Sunday, the last Sunday in the week of September. So, you know, we'll, we'll show the Halloween decorations for the full, for, for the whole October, for the whole month of October. So, I mean, I guess it's not too early. I would say for this week, since it is the last week of September, I mean, people will go ahead and start decorating. But, I mean, two weeks ago that my granddaddy called and told me, People putting up Halloween decorations. I just think that was way too early for, you know, two weeks ago. Because, I mean, we were only between halfway between September or, you know, just starting off. So, um, you know, I mean, and that's how it is. Like, you know, people will get Christmas decorations out, like, after, I like, at near the end of October. I mean, uh, so, I mean, it sounds, it sounds like the, they're, they're trying to go ahead and rush and get all the decorations out. Go decorate for Halloween, people. I mean, after you watch our show. I mean, but yeah, I decorate for Halloween. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a big decorative person. So yes, I mean, I made my sister make little ghosts for me to put up in my room. <laughs> for to put up in my room this week. I'm like, you were making some ghosts. And, and she said, you better help me. And I did, and I helped her. She made cute little spider webs and all this. And we have some of the stuff hanging in my room. I kind of decorated way too early for Halloween. So yes, I'm I'm kind of I was kind of like on the early decorative list this year. But anyway, uh, today's Throwback Celebrity Thursday. We're gonna have oh today we're gonna show Jesse McCartney is gonna sing for us. Woo, Jesse McCartney. Yes, he is so cool and it's very talented and he hasn't been mentioned a lot in the news lately because I remember he was like the big thing back when I was younger. Now he needs to be a Big pop star, talented singer. He still is today. He will sing for us when we come back. Don't go, everyone. We'll be right back in. Coming up next, we will have Jesse McCartney perform for us on our for Throwback Celebrity Thursday. Don't go away. We'll be right back in a moment. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our show. It's the Throwback Celebrity Thursday. Yes, I love Throwback Celebrity Thursday to. You know, for us to mention all the celebrities that haven't been, you know, mentioned in a while. So I'm really glad that we get to mention them on our show right here in Noah Chat Live. 
And now, everyone, please welcome Jesse McCartney. He's singing his song. He's singing one of his hit songs right now. So take it away, Jesse McCartney. How do you, how do you say, how do you say, baby, all that I hear 
my friends again, again, and again. I'm ask about you. They say, we saw the girl the game. Damn, we gotta see if we can stay for you. Not only does your body bang, but I missed the conversation too. Tell me that you give me all sleep, can't think, can't be here. Cause if I have my way, come and get you, girl. It's time for Daddy to make some funny. Wow. Yeah, we got all of this at Walmart. Really? The decorations, the tablecloths, all of the food. And we even saved enough money for the... The, um... <laughs> for the clown outfit. Unbeatable prices, backed by our price match guarantee. Save money, live better. Walmart. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our show. This is very exciting. Everyone that has liked our Facebook page, facebook.com slash Noah Chat Live, and you still go like it now, or follow us on Twitter at Noah Chat Live. We've been telling you all this month of September to be, remember, watching our show, liking our Facebook page, or not. You can either follow us on Twitter. You don't have to do both, but you have to do at least one of them. And you can win this free Fate Force sign cookbook, everyone. We're fixing to the, announce the winner right now. Let me get out my big box to draw. So, yes. And we made it fair. We put everyone's name in this drawing box that has recently liked our Facebook page and our Twitter page. We have tons of names in here. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to say something in the box. Oh, there are. Don't want that to happen. Here we go, everyone. The winner is about to be announced. Oh, my gosh. I never made this value for a drawing so I'm like, you know what, I'm going to open this up. I don't want all the names to fall out. Let me push your names back. Names! Don't fall out. Okay. Yeah. The winner is about to be announced. Deborah Tamer! Oh my gosh, you won the free face for a cup of. Woo! Deborah Tamer! This is what you have won. Woo! Congratulations to Deborah Tamer. She will be taking home a free Fake Four cookbook signed by actress Fake Four. Great delicious recipes in the Fake Four Cooking with Fake Cooper. Congratulations to Deborah Tabor. She's getting right on and she's signing a cookbook and you will be getting it in, in the mail soon. So congratulations, Deborah Tamer. You're reading a free Fate Four cookbook signed by actress Fate Four. Congratulations, Deborah Tabor. Everyone have a great Thursday. We'll see you tomorrow Friday. Bye, everyone. Woo! <laughs> congratulations to Deborah Tabor winning the free Fate Four cooking with Fate Cookbook. Remember, you can still like our Facebook page at facebook.com slash NoahChatLive or not follow us on Twitter at NoahChatLive. Have a great Thursday. We'll see you tomorrow Friday. Bye-bye, everyone.